What's happening, everybody? I'm Grillmaster. Welcome back to more of uh, Epic Chef. I'm glad you guys enjoyed this. I, I honestly had a lot of fun with this. Uh, we need to go to the Northern Beach Cave. So that's where it's telling us to go. I think we have several missions. I just don't remember how to get there. Wait, 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 wait. F menu? Shortcut bar. Nope, that's not what I want. I don't know. I don't remember how. Okay, Q. There it is. Go to the airship workshop. Okay. Uh, I want to do this first. I could have sworn I got a mission to go to, like, the rat place or something. I don't know. I don't know. So this game, it only saves when you sleep, which I play a lot of games where that's a thing. Oh, what's this? An egg, a mysterious egg. Never seen anything like this. I don't think it's from a local species. Perhaps Deck would be able to tell me something about it? Okay, I got a new... All right. Go talk to him. Hey, buddy. Wait, why would he know anything about? It? Why would he know anything about it? Hey, Spec. Hey, Zest. You you visited the carpenter already? Just follow the street and turn left twice if you can. Yeah, yeah. Well, no, the, the egg. No, you told me to talk to you about. The, do I have to actually have it in my like hot pot? Hey, Speck, I found this egg at the villa. Any idea what it might be? Well, I can tell you what it looks like. It looks ominous, and you should throw it off the cliff. I'm preferring knowing what it is. You really like pushing your luck, eh? Anyone who could help? Well, there's the doctors. Right at the end of the street. They've been on all kinds of expeditions. They, may, they know their stuff. Adventurers? Dear God, no. The researchers, or were. They'll be happy to help. I'll pay them a visit then. Thanks, Speck. My pleasure. All right. Go into town and show this to the doctors then. I want to know what this is. I know we can, we, like, our one of our goals is to buy a bed, but we don't have money, so... That ain't gonna happen. I'm mean, gonna have $200, I guess. No, was it... I don't remember if it was money or what it was. This? Wait, what? There's nobody here. Hello? Supposed to be somebody here? Okay, number four. Apparently, they were just not showing up. Old couple. I'm Zeth, the new neighbor in the villa. I heard you were doctors of some kind with advanced knowledge of flora and fauna. You were wrong, I'm afraid. Have I? Yes, because we're we still are doctors. Touche. Once a doctor, always a doctor, right, dear? Indeed. Then maybe you can tell me what the strange egg I found? I think it belongs to local fauna. Oh, and why would you think that? Some degree of education myself. Do you now? And what's your field of expertise? I studied uh, paleontology. Well, I guess someone has to do it. Of course, lad. Paleontologists have done a lot of good for mealtime conversations. <laughs> you know what it is or not. Oh, don't be like that. We're just kidding. But yeah, we know about eggs like this, right? Bl Blida? The portal expedition? Oh yes, what an adventure. Commander Belfonte was very bold leading that one. But we came back with a lot of knowledge, didn't we? Say these came from another plane or something. Originally, yes, but even with the portals closed, a lot of species had already escaped into our world. Portals were bad news back then? Is it dangerous? Hmm, the colors. This one belongs to a Ligurn. Also known as the Mysterian Hello. Hello, Postrich? I had to come up with a lot of names on that trip. I managed to tame those. Transport. They were quite versatile because they could summon them anyway. That's interesting. I'll need some special equipment if you want to do that, though. Tools the mages made up for us. You could tame one with those in no time. I think we still have one around if you're interested. I am. But first, we'll need to recharge them, dear. Remember the thing about the bait and food and all that? True. We need a well-cooked crab. Very spiritual. Crab? The favorite food of the Ligurn. Yes, it's part of the taming process. A magical mumbo-jumbo. So I can cook it up for you. Good. We'll prepare the tools in the meantime. Okay. So I need to cook a crab for them. Alright. Well, get out of this. Go to the airship workshop. I mean, I, I, I can't do the cooking thing, can I? I don't know. I'm gonna put that away for now. All right, and there's lots of places all over the all over. There's lots of places all over the place. 
this. Hello? Hi there. Hello, young one. Enjoying the day? I'm actually looking for seaweed. For my recipe. Sitting here. I doubt you're gonna get the seaweed by sitting on a bench. Maybe. Maybe not. The universe shall decide if I get my ingredients. She'll be at peace with whatever it has in store for me. Ah. Uh -huh. Also be very grateful to the universe if it provided me with the seaweed and stacks of tin. I see. I'm sure the universe will keep that in mind. Alright. Uh, hangar. Vela kitchen. Oh, I don't even know what that said. Uh, hello? Do I need to come to this side of the table? Can I, can I talk to you? Okay, are you lost, partner? Oh, is this the Mag Magiflight service? I'm possessed upon this note at the Southern Gate Gondola Station. I was wondering if it could be possible to restore its functionality. Ah, the Magic Flight Service and their gondolas ceased to exist a long time ago, friend. They ran out of magically charged crystals when all the mages focused on the war against the homogeny. They stopped providing any superfluous, superfluous, superfluous. My God, magical use. I can't say the word right now. I see. And who are you, then, if you don't mind me asking? I'm Hadriv, and this is Mundane Wonders Inc. Quite the oxymoronic name what is it you do it's not moronic at all we're developing an air cruiser that doesn't rely on magic or wizards we call it the prosiac 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 you mean that thing over there I wouldn't exactly call it a revolution or a cruiser for that matter that's the sputnik just a prototype functional one mind you fully operation with no magic involved we can believe that but why is it so important not to have mages involved not like we have a shortage of the buggers tell you don't have one of them around or at a very crucial time, or you're from a species who is un unable to use magic or politics come into play. Not to mention that when magicka fails, it fails spectacularly. One wrong move and you find your country in sudden full of dragons from another plane. Yeah, that's not good. Or alternative magicka free system is a revolutionary way to fight global war worming. <laughs> Alright. I don't know. I haven't seen all that many dragons in my lifetime. Yeah, but when you accident actually get to see the dragon, it might be too late to do anything about it. I see. And how are your scare tactics going? Badly. We need funding to continue with our main project, but it turns out no one is very interested in our vision when a mage can do it ten times better in half the time. We got out the last near apocalypse not even ten years ago, and people still rely on magicka like it's like there's no tomorrow. Or don't care whether or not there will be one. Soon we won't be able to pay for the bills. I fear we might have to abandon the project altogether. Not entirely surprised, considering that your business model consists of scaring people enough for them to throw money at you in hopes it makes you go away. Yeah, I understand. But we need funding. Prozac. Prozac? Prozac? Important? I want, you want to say Prozac. <laughs> I believe you've been sitting on top of the solution all along. Maybe you were too obsessed with getting funding to see it. Not many people are going to pay for lectures and promises, but how many people will be willing to pay for a lift across town? Something that used to be reserved for the wealthy, but now can be used by anyone. I mean, like a magic flight service. I mean, technically it could work. But it's not very glamorous. Cheap and functional, isn't that the idea? With a couple of small, simple boats? Much like your prototype, you'll be able to not only fund yourselves, but you'd show people your magic of free flight tech actually works. No, you might be right. Not the most charming job, but it has potential as a business. Prototype still works, maybe not all is lost, but I need my sons. Okay, look for your sons. I wasn't suggesting that you should. If you were about to, we're gonna find them. <laughs> Around the district, they'll be easy to spot. We all dress very much alike. Find all seven of them and tell them to come back here while I work on a briefing. Wait, seven? Your wife must be a hero. <laughs> she was, oh she was. I see. If I can find, I'll, I'll see if I can find your sons. I'll be here, making sure this is feasible. Okay, so I gotta find seven people that look exactly like him. All right, not a problem. Um, I, I mean, I don't feel like I need that as a tracking thing. Go here. I'll run around town and see if I can find him. I mean. The outfit? Are you with Hadra? And you? Take that as yes. Your your boss says he needs you all back at the workshop. Okay. And that makes it. The cat just barked like a dog. 
Um, all right. <laughs> that just threw me off a little bit. Hey, Seagull, I'm going to come take your egg. Thank you. Is there anything down there? I'm kind of, I haven't really explored the town at all, so I'm kind of just checking out the town walls to see if I can find the sun's round. I do remember that one of those cat guys was somewhere else, towards like the place we first entered the town at. Okay, don't see anything really down, oh, there's one down there. What's this? Port Authority. All right. Is this one of them? It's one of them, right? No, another Aryan with the, that outfit. Are you with Hadra too? Mew. I see. He needs all of you at the workshop. Mew. Okay. Flirt. Gonna make a shipment? Not really. I was looking for a job. Ah, check with scheduled department shipments board. Trace corresponding goods in stacks of the specified amount, and we'll take them. You supply a lot of people, so buy everything you bring. Fixed price, though, no haggling. Okay. Uh, can I just fall off here? No, I can't. I was hoping that was a chest that I could open. There's a no. Right, run around here. Oh, wait, rats. I needed these for something. I need you for something, and I don't remember. I thought that, see, that was, that's one of the missions I thought I had was like get ten rats. It may have just been one of those little like mission things that. Oh, oh here's a crab. Give me you. Yeah, now I can cook that. All right. Uh, give me this egg. Rubia. All right. Well, what, what do you want? Hey there, mister. I thought I'd see you around here eventually. Eh, do I know? I'm Sc Scrabba, bar owner and professional smuggler. Thought my bar is going through some difficulties at the moment, so I guess I'm only a smuggler for the time being. You say it just like that? You're a temperess. And Cordy really is something else. Lucky for you, eh, stowaway? Yes, lucky for me indeed. Don't worry, I'm no gossiper. You'll fit in just fine in the old port district. Everyone minds their own business. I hope. Not quite from the district, though. I'm in a state right by the southern gate. Ah, so the rumors are true. Someone is crazy enough to actually live in that old villa. Uh, it's just an old building of a le with a legend. Not the first one I've slept in, but maybe the first one I've slept in legally. <laughs> a stowaway and a squatter. And a reckless one to boot. You'll fit in with fine, mister. Desk. And a false name. You've got everything, man. Could you have gone for something a bit less extravagant? Sorry that my name is something not perfectly fine and normal like Scraba. Ouch. Touché. Don't worry, I won't ask, as I said, I am no gossiper. Mm -hmm. So what brings you to my little establishment? Well, I was hoping to get my to wet my whistle. I see the place is looking a bit dry at the moment. And through better times, it seems that my flies are out of reach now. Guess I'll be staying sober then. On a completely unrelated matter, maybe you could do a little something for me. What something? My friend, Sergeant Chambez. He has not been feeling like himself lately. Maybe you could give him a small arrival present. Yeah, cook him something. He stands on guard for long hours. I'm sure he'd love anything containing apples. Sure. Huh, just like that, no questions? Nah. <laughs> Tell me when you've given him the dish. He tends to hang around the eastern gate during the day. Meet me here when you're done. Oh, don't mention me. I see. Alright. Apparently you gave me another thing. Hey, where's one of the people? Ah, another one. Starting to see a pattern here. With Hadra? Yeah. I see. He needs you at the workshop. Alright. That's what, three? The three or four? I actually don't even know. Alright, that's cool. I got another mission. I got... Like, three of the cat people. I guess we'll just keep going up. Maybe there'll be some more right around here. No, this is okay. No, now I, I know where I'm at. This is where I actually like turned back there and went the other way. Do you have a mission too, then? I'm a tello. Oh my god, what am I gonna do? Seem trouble. I need to supply the Calarian Town Tower with fresh tomatoes, but O'Reilly won't sell them to me because I 
I said his beard looks like a handful of carrots. Think about pots and kettles, but maybe I'll be able to help with that. How many do you need? You can help? Thank Tempress. I'll buy a stack. I'll buy them in packs of 15. You want tomatoes? I mean, I have four. God. Okay, properties of that. I. Oh, you use this thing as bait to catch things? Fire, goldfish, mud eel? I didn't even know you could fish. I guess it makes sense. Most cooking games have that. Carpentry. Oh, okay, now I kind of know where I'm at again. How's it going, buddy? Ah, you're one of Hadrives. I'm not asking. I just know. Go to the workshop. He needs you all there. I have three more to go. Well, that answers how many more I need to find. All right. Uh, I think I see one straight in front of me. Yeah, there's this one just hanging out over here. Hey, buddy. You're one of Hadrives. Go to the workshop. Don't ask. Of two more to find. Okay. Why does this have a little thing? I don't... Okay. Whatever, man. Okay, so I've been through all this part, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we're, we've been down here. Uh, it means the only place left would be the other side of town. And I want to say I did see somebody over there. I want to go check this out real quick. And I'm assuming this is some sort of cooking competition, right? What's your cooking tournament? Anyone can join. No license needed. We got the permissions and everything. What is this? This is a benefit tournament. All money will be donated to the Armless Children Foundation. Oh, they're going to buy them prosthetics? Prosthesis? No, they're going to buy them swords so they can embark on their personal quest to save the world. I see. Armless. Dear Tempest. If you want to join the tournament, your omen is very cheap. Just five... E no, I'm good. This amazing chef outfit. I mean, don't get me wrong, I really would love that chef outfit. Not right now. Never understood why a Fulger, you have armed teenagers wandering around and doing the job of armies should be good. That's more of a safety measure in case some doomsday scenario is sneaking under our noses. They're good at detecting them. They're good at detecting them because most of the time they're the ones causing them. You're lost, you'll be changing what that tune when one of them saves you from the darkness in your heart. Yeah, I'm dying to receive an existential lesson from a 14-year-old serial killer. Okay. <laughs> Dear God. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, I thought I just saw something back there. So I need to... I'm assuming it's not back there. Right. This weird dude. Yeah, see, this is the one I talked to before. Talked to this guy. Need you at the workshop, head over there, I'll look for the last one of your people left wondering about. Okay, so there's one left somewhere, and I'm not sure where. Five rats. Okay, so yeah, you're the one looking for five rats. Alright. I want to talk to this guy, but... Oh, sir, you want to have a good time? Uh, uh, sorry, I'm not into that kind of stuff. So what kind of stuff? Well, the costume and all that, I'm judging you. Again. <laughs> you are anything. I mean, anyone has, everyone has preferences. The mascot outfit, Mr. Generate publicity for my fair. And you have a very sick mind. <laughs> uh, what kind of fair? Sharky's Treasure Cove Fair, right here in the Old Port District. Open every afternoon by the Windmill Overlook. The greatest treasure in Accordia awaits you. Okay, keep that in mind. Just treasure twice, though. Maybe it's a bit redundant. Booty, then? Greatest booty in Accordia. <laughs> Might attract the wrong crowd. Come on, man, get some help. <laughs> Oh, that's awesome. All right. There's one more of those freaking cat people around, and I don't know where. I have... Frick just happened. How did the screen explode? I, I don't know. I don't know. I mean, isn't it down here? Don't I have to go this way? Oh, wait. No, it's I see where I need to go. Oh, this disappeared because it went past a certain time. Oh. So yeah, I need to go down there. And really, that's the only place I haven't looked for the cat guy at. So I guess we're going to go down there. Well, that's happening. Holy loud. 
Okay, well, I have to go through there. I mean, that's just a whole thing happening right now. Alright, well, I'm out here on the beach. Hey, here's the last one. Ma, I finally found you. Oh, Hydra wants you at the workshop. I guess I'll be joining you guys later. Alright. Found them all. Grab all these. Is there like a limit to how much I can carry? Does it go down to here? I guess we'll find out. Give me this, give me that. Hey, I got seaweed. Change clothes? Oh, I can change my outfit here. Oh, I can put on a swimsuit. Nice. This is where I'm supposed to be going, I think. There's like a whole thing down here. Hello? Welcome. Please browse as much as you want. I'll be here. Browse? You're not here to buy anything? Uh, buy what exactly? Oh, you must be new. This is my vintage cha vintaging chamber? A place where people come from all around town, bring their unused stuff so I can gain class and value over time. So a dump. Not a dump. I've made tons of escudos selling to the high society. The snobs from the upper town come in search of rare pieces to decorate their home. They pay good money for them. Does that happen very often? Well, once or twice. A week? No, once or twice so far. I see. So, want to buy something? Uh, do you have victory tokens? Or there's a chef around here willing to part with one of those. Hmm, how do you know that? Found I found Jesus. <laughs> he sent me to the right path. Ah, oh, Jesus, I trust him. So is it true? Yes, you found your man. But your man is not a man, I am the chef you are. Never said I was looking for a man. Oh, but you asked him if he had a token. Oh, well, he was the only person around, and you were in the latrine. This is not a latrine, I was just waiting in here. Waiting for what? For an idiot in need of a token. Are you that idiot? I might be. How much? Hold your horses. I'm not selling the token directly. I'm selling the chance to earn it. I can't give the thing away just like that. You need to beat best me at a little culinary duel. Just like the real thing, we need, we'll need cook, both cook a few dishes. Slothy here will judge what he likes the most. If you win, you get the token. If you don't. You don't. No refund. So you're a professional chef, and the judge is going to be this guy I just met who lives in a junkyard. All well, seems perfectly legit, not a scam by any stretch of the imagination. <laughs> not my friend, this guy used to be with the Critic Union. He's not gonna lie about what the dish is that he likes more. He used to be the one, the fancy critics? I was, yes. So they kicked me out. You can trust my judgment, though. I'm still certified, even if I'm independent now. Why did they kick you out? They said I was too lazy. Too lazy to be a critic. That's a special talent you have there. Well, you too. What? I don't... What just happened? <laughs> Guess I really don't have much of a choice. How much do we want? First, you need a cooking license. We're talking an official token here. It's already risking you enough to bet it for money. I'm not going to go as far as risk losing it to an illegal. If you don't have one yet, you may want to check out the old plaza during the day. If you have a license, then it will be a hundred escudos on top. Ugh, guess I'll have to come back when I'm ready to be swindled. Remember to bring your ingredients for a two-dish combat as well. Supplies are not included in the price. Okay. So, wait. You have an exclamation mark above your head now. Hey, Zest, was it? Yes. Are you a friend of Jesus? Yeah, well, friend would be a big word. Hmm, I see. Yeah, there's a whole bunch of crap topping, popping up at the top. Would you want some advice? Would I? Bring some sauce. Harabara should do, and you should have some practice at the tournament by the eastern gate. Just to have, you know, a chance. Chance, eh? I see someone has a guilty conscience. Are you afraid that Jesus will find out that you're running a scam operation? No, no, I swear I'm a fair judge. Just giving you a tip to make things a little more interesting. Fine. I'll make sure to bring some Karibarash sauce. And I might check out this tournament as well. Okay. So, I guess we just go back up and we're good? Oh, 
Oh, it's just the thing telling me to go in there. I thought that was like something I gotta shoot, but I was like, I don't have anything to shoot stuff with, so I don't know. Alright, where's my inventory sitting? I got a bunch of crabs now. Guess I can try to go home and cook them? I feel like it got a little bit busier here. So I love the people just beat the crab out of each other. Alright. Um, talk to I, I. I'm assuming I probably can't talk to the guy right now, but I will try. Where Where am I going? Right here. I mean, maybe it's still open. It's 9 p.m. though. Closed. Yeah, that's what I figured. For it to be closed because it'd be, you know, it's nighttime right now. Okay. I mean, it's like nighttime is the best time. I guess I just need to go back home. Okay, yeah. I was like, I think this is the right way. I'm not 100% sure. Alright. How's it going, buddy? Just because it, like, separates it so it's not loading it all in at once, I'm assuming. Wait, what's this? Why is there a yellow thing here? I won't explode the forest before we can have a good night's rest. Bed comes first. Oh, that's right, that's right, that's right. I remember we went over that before, and we had to actually have, like, the actual bed, not the blank bed that we have right now. But in order to do that, I think I was like, I needed $300 or something like that. I don't remember exactly what it was. I remember it wasn't cheap. Either resource-wise or money-wise. I don't remember which one it was that we needed, though. Alright, grab you, grab you, grab you, 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 you. Have I talked to you lately? Do you have anything for me? What's happening? Uh... I don't know what that did. What did you, what were you doing? I just got a whole bunch of points and stuff and things, but I don't know why. Oh, let's call it a day. I should turn home and get some sleep. That's what I'm going to do right now. Sleepy time. On the terrible mattress. Time to go to bed, I suppose. Come on, Zest. It's just an old building. The worst things to worry about. All right. Hmm? Now what's happening? Is that just somebody? I, it's like so faint. Oh dear, I definitely heard something. Okay, don't panic. I'm a grown man. Check out the house thoroughly. Alright. Nothing. There's no one here. I mean, place is really haunted? No, don't be ridiculous. Must have been the wind, yes. The wind going through the cracks in the walls. I'll go back to bed and just think real hard that the explanation makes perfect sense. <laughs> I like that. It's like a super extra, very super quiet, faint scream. Dear Tempest. This keeps up, I'm going to die of sleep deprivation. I'm starting to feel a little bit worried here, but what can I do? <sighs> Alright. Alright. We need to go talk to Hadriv or whatever, but we got three hours to do it, so I'm gonna go try to cook this crab. Um, cook. So, don't know how to do this best. Right, I mean, the fact that I have two of the blue, is that good? Grab. Keep it from burning. All right. Oh, okay, we're good. Uh, okay. All right, that's good. Okay, now add tomatoes. Alright, a little bit of aroma score. Oh god, we gotta not burn. Don't burn, don't burn. 
Am I good? Okay, it can only be three. That's fine. Okay. Oh, I burnt one of the things. Crab cakes and fungi bites and a fruit compote. Um, <laughs> this is the wrong thing. I want this. Cook license, get some sauce. Cook license at the Comarian stand during the day. Okay. Uh, it's crab for the doctors. Spiritual of 12. Okay, we have 13. Still have this too to sell. I'm assuming I sell these things. What's this? No, 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 no. If I'm, if I'm, if I'm gonna, no, I don't even want to sell this. I mean, well, actually, whatever. Eat. All right. So I'm level three now. New synergy unlocked is eggs. All right, cool. Good night. Okay, so let's say we start with. Well, it's telling me to start with this. Right. What else can I add? Add a rat? <laughs> Why not? All right. And then add a tomato. Wow. All right. I got another great dish. Cook up a rat here real quick. It's fine. Here, tartar and vermin slices and a fruit combo. <laughs> All right. This is good. Uh, can I put that away? There we go. You run really slowly when you have that out. Okay. So, gather up these things real quick. So there is a limit on these, by the way. I kind of noticed. I, di I didn't realize last time. Just slowly. Oh, and the apple. I didn't gather you yesterday. Curses. Right, didn't somebody tell me that they wanted me to make something for something with apples in it? Is it gonna poison him? I'm afraid it's gonna poison him. He's gonna be allergic to apples. I hope that's not the case. Don't make me kill a man with apples. I can do this, so this will be fine. Right? Oh good. Oh, it's level five. All right, and tomato. All right, I'm trying to I'm trying to figure out this aroma thing. Okay, we're as good as we're gonna get. Carrot tartar and crispy peel and f and a fruit compote. Okay. This so I can just put that away. Okay, so I have several missions. I have the crab thing. I have the meal for Sergeant Gerber's Chumbas. <laughs> Just gonna snake random sounds and hope one of them's correct. Alright. 8 a.m. already. We got an hour until that place opens up. Okay. I'm hoping the next time I can play this is on the other in the new computer. My card tomorrow. Supposedly. Could be later, who knows, but. Hopefully tomorrow. Because I notice this is like every once in a while I have frame drops when it's like specifically out there in the grass. Here, not so much, but out there in the grass, yes. Um, hello? Are they not loaded in yet? Is that what's happening? Does he not show up until 9 a.m.? Or later? Could be later even. Oh, nope, let's try now. Uh, yes. Sergeant Chumbas. Yes? I have a present for you. Present, eh? Let me taste it. Chomp chomp. Ah, uh, yes. I see. The freshness of those apples reminds me of the winds from the east at dawn. Ah, oh, how nice. You hear that? Winds from the east at dawn. Yes, I heard it. Must be very nice wind. I, I'm not sure you get the explanation. Perhaps someone else would get it. Oh, I guess so. Oh, you mean, oh, yeah. That's what it's all about. Winds from the west of dawn. Got it. 
East. Stop point winking, you bloody idiot. Now go. Okay. Um. I don't want to go back to her right now because she's all far away. Okay. Uh. Crab. I have to cook crab. Good. Let us squeeze it into the thingy. I'll be right back. Here, here you are. It's. I think it still works. No thing can help me tame the ostrich. Summon it. Whenever you need it. Yes. Almost like having a horse in your pouch. Call them pocket mount. Sounds practical. Now I just need to wait for the egg to hatch. That might be a problem. We've only seen those eggs hatch when exposed to extreme magic emission. We're talking flames of pure energy. Not exactly common. Might have wanted to start by telling me that you little that little detail. Just remembered how we had to hatch them for study. We needed to borrow some top-notch magical military hardware. You mean like one of those golems? Yeah, things like that. I don't think the Infinagon would be happy to humor you, though. Don't worry. I think I'll find a way. You're very helpful, doctors. It's been a pleasure. See you around, Zest. Drop by whenever you feel like it. <clears throat> All right. <laughs> I feel like... Ever since Lobotomy Corporation... And I gave like all the different characters voices. I don't even intend to do it necessarily. But it's like I catch myself doing it. I mean I don't have a problem with that. But it's just it's weird because it's like it's un this subconscious thing that I end up. Alright. Found them all things. Zest. I hope my kids didn't give you too much trouble. Yeah your kids. What? What? What do you mean what? They're full bloody Narians? Cat tech if I'm not mistaken. Every last one of them. So. Do it yourself. Only want to know. Want to be the one to burst your bubble. Ah, no need to give the birds and the bees talk, Zest. There's no time for that. And we've we've got we've we've got work to do. Kids, I hope you use this little lapse and rest because we're back in business. No, we didn't get the government contract, but we'll get funding anyway. No, Doriamond. No heist. I already told you. No, that's simple. We'll become a local transport company. <laughs> Be my disappointment. My <laughs> Katniss is freaking out right now. Shut it, all of you. That's enough. Make, watch your language, Dormund. I think the boys need some perspective. Sure. We all want the Prosiac to be spectacular. It will be the achievement of a lifetime. But have you boys forgotten why we're doing this? All of this. The real goal always was to improve the lives of the regular folk, reduce the magic of dependence. The ship is not only our dream, but a symbol of the new way to do things. Wouldn't it be fitting to be able to fund it through those very same means? You may think that that's no glory in this task, but if it isn't our time, neither is the pro's day. And we'll be buying double cat and rations with the extra money. <laughs> so are you with me? Want to get rich and show these mages how it's done? Wow. And let's get to work. I want the Sputnik in the air in less than an hour. Move it. All right. Thank you, Zest. We'll be covering all the stations in the city starting right now. I've sent you one of the kids to restore the one near the villa. That one won't be profitable at all, but I think it's only fair to get something in return. Take this as well. Ooh. Hey, all of this will come in handy. Thank you. Now that I think about it, I don't even know what it is that you do. Guess I'm sort of a chef? Lovely trade. Anywhere else, at least. <laughs> we can still help each other out. Talk to me later if you're interested. I got a pilot hat. And a jumpsuit. Boy, you guys are love, love exercising, eh? Not exercising, just they're generating energy. You don't use magic here, you know? So we have to do with this... What is happening? That was insane. Generating energy. We don't use magic here, you know. So we have to do it this way. Looks exhausting. It is and hungry. Say, you're a cook, right? Sort of. If you bring us some decent food, we'll pay you for it. But we need energetic food, so the more vigor the dishes has, the more we'll pay you. It's happening, right? This is weird. There's like so much happening in the background. I'll think about it. All right. Lots of food with vigor. Okay. Oh, this is cool. So, like, another airship is just dropping in. 
All right, well, this is this is this is crazy. So much just started happening in there that was, was just dead in there before. Uh, no, I keep I keep pushing tab, thinking that's gonna take me here. Okay, uh, golem at home, so I need to go talk to the golem. Yes, I can go talk to her. Get a cook license. This is the main priority. This is what I need to go focus on. So let's go get a cook license real quick before we do anything else. Maybe I'll go talk to the lady on the beach. Oh, this is the... I didn't realize it was literally here. Ah, oh, Mr. Zest, are you interested in acquiring a cook license for a thousand... Oh. Not at the moment, no. I see, in that case, you'll excuse me, I've got things to do. I didn't realize it was a frickin' thousand dollars. Alright, well, let's go talk to the lady. Maybe she'll give us money, too. 650 bucks right now. I mean, it's not too shabby. What's this? Hello? Hello, sir. Please fill the browse my wares. Nice shop you have here. I only sort of have it. This is part of a dwarven franchise, and I need to stick to the business model guideline. Let's see. Can you buy some veggies for me? You must be that guy who moved into the villa. I'm afraid you have a hard time selling anything at a fair price. What? Why? place is cursed. Most merchants won't risk selling a turnip that might turn into a bear overnight and eat the family dog. And with good reason, I must say. Nonsense. No, it isn't. I should know, but I'm willing to give you a chance. Buy your surplus for a marginal profit, but just because I hate seeing it go to waste. I'd be able to resell it for compost. Or with a disclaimer. Sound very encouraging. If I were you, I'd look for people who are desperate or in a hurry if you want to get good business. Speaking of business, want to try something, mister? Best. Timmit O'Reilly. Riley? Yeah, right. Really. Really. <laughs> uh, please. Don't, don't do that again. Sorry, Zest. It's sort of a family curse. Want to buy something? Yes. Oh, you got seeds for me. Okay, anything? Uh, we got rice seeds. 180? Oh my god. How many extras do I have? Two, four, six, eight. I have eight, I have five, four, six. I'll sell three. One. Oh, those don't have much of a value at all. My plans do. All right, I'm at $778. Let's go talk to her. If she gives us 200, then we'll get close to where we need to be. Quite where we need to be, but we'll at least be close to where we need. To be. Okay, it was the east winds or something. Hopefully, I don't have to remember because I don't remember. I think it was the east winds, but I really don't remember. Yeah, hey, there's another crab down here, and another seagull egg. All right. Hey, Zest, how's it going? Given your Friend, the present. Have you now? Did he say something? He mentioned the winds from the east at dawn, or was it dusk? No, no, it was definitely dawn. Eh, dawn or dusk, this. It's a bit of a life or death thing. Dawn, definitely. You sure? Things can get pretty messy if you're re remembering it wrong. Yes, I'm sure. Yeah, maybe next time you send someone to get coded message from a guard, you remind him to bring a notebook. Oh, well. I have to trust your memory. Here, have this. It's something I kept for one of my deals. Uh, thanks. It is I who thank you, Zest. You've helped me with my business to get my business running again. An adventure armor. Oh, I was hoping for money. Oh, I was like, wait, what happened? Remember. Remember. What do you mean remember? Uh, my one to help Scott was placed in mind. I mean, you say something useful in the future. Can I talk to you now and get something? He's this, doing fine, I see. Uh, glad to see you around. Hey, Scrabba, staying out of trouble? Trouble? Me? Never. Cheers. So I, it actually is going to be later. Rat! Another rat! What does that give me? Three? If I could find two more, then I can go give them to that one person for something. Come here. Run away from me. There we go. Alright. Well, here we go. Have what I need. Okay, I got five rats. Go give this to the person in the front. I don't know how much money they'll give me, but hey, maybe it'll be something. It probably won't be enough for everything, but who knows. 
Who knows? I don't know how to make it a stack. What's this? Hammer. Oh, that's right, to break stuff if, it, if I need to. Well, can that be down here? Alright, there we go. I want to see about hatching this egg thing. I think that'd be really cool. But I've been running around town so much, I don't even know. Hey, Catman, right? Or no, wait, wait. Oh yeah, it's you. I was like, wait, who am I supposed to talk to? Oh, the rats is fantastic. Here's some money for you, friend. Catch more, I'd be happy to take them off your hands. Oh my god. Like, selling rats, you get $5 a piece. Giving it to him? It's got so much. Magic Emporium. I don't want this. I want the carpentry place. I'm pretty sure I haven't... I don't know. Maybe we should save the money. Yeah. I'm gonna go sell one more thing. Now I can get this, get this chef license. Oh, boy. All right. You. Yes. Alright, I'm gonna sell you egg. Hey, you got a thousand six dollars. I didn't have to really ditch that much. The eggs I get like every day all the time. Alright, you. Yes. Yes, I got the money. Splendid, in that case, just fill out this form. And sign here and here and here. That should do it. Congratulations, Mrs. S. You have a basic cook license that allows you to participate in official events. To make the deal even sweeter for you, have this. Sauce workshop. Uh, thanks? What is this? It's a sauce station. You'll find the station sauces will open up the world of possibilities. Remember to experiment and have fun. Bureaucracy achievement. Alright. Cool. God, I'm just like... Freaking completing so much crap really fast and it's awesome. <laughs> I love it. Whoa. Alright. So I guess it's up and running now. So wait, what is is it literally just a transport service? Sorry, sir, you cannot board an airship right now, you have to wait until after five PM. What? Why? Is that just when the next one shows up? I have no clue. Alright, well let's go talk to you about hatching this egg. Wanna hatch this egg? Number five. I slowed down as soon as I brought it out. Was not ready to apparently get. Hey there, could you blast this egg with the beam of energy? You know, golem style. Insufficient data. Please supply var variables to the conditional. This again. What is it? Grammar day? Searching database. According to the registered almanacs, it's currently in grammar day. <laughs> it's grammar day. In Lork, Cow capital of the province of Merlia. In Zoon, voted the most boring city in the continent for three years in a row. Thank you. Now, can you blast this egg with magical energy so it hatches? Only reacts to extreme flows magica, so, or so they say. Affirmative. Hand over the target to infuse. Okay. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. This doesn't look like an ostrich at all. This can instantly summon Birch to his location with shift. This can ride Birch by standing near his front and pressing. This can use Birch as extra storage by standing near his hindquarters and pressing button. Birch requires feeding with cooked dishes. Give each Birch, equip the dish, stand face to face, and press up. I got a merchant outfit now. Son of a birch, that was the name of the achievement I just got. Awesome. Who is this? Oh. What's up, dude? No, I wanna I wanna ride you. I feel like I'm playing Pixar right now. <laughs> Alright. I don't know exactly how this helps me, but that's cool. I mean it's cool that it has extra space and stuff. Mental note. Mental note. Doctors are good people. Maybe I counted them when I need a helping hand. Okay, so I need to defeat you to get that, but I need more money. Oh yeah, did did, did they give me like an actual? Is it a thing inside? Oh. Hit shift. I'm gonna I'm gonna do that a lot. I just hit shift. I'm trying to do something else and proceed to pop that guy out of nowhere. 
Okay. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Yeah, it's gonna be something I have to actually make. Just hit me. I was like, it's probably gonna be something I have to make out here. Not something that just automatically goes inside. Uh, apple wood plank. Wait, I gotta chop down the apple tree? I gotta chop down the apple tree. Sounds terrible, man. Oh, and it is! Oh, God, it hurts me. I don't want to chop it down, but I want to make this thing because I need the sauce. Oh, fine. I don't have a choice. Chop our tree down to make sauces. Doop, doop, doop. Eh. Wait, is it going to regrow? Oh, tell me you're regrowing because I see a thing down there. Dude, I I hate that. It freaks me out every time. I mean, I don't know. I don't really hate that, but it freaks me out every time. What is? What's the way? Wait. What's up? What am I seeing over here? What? Grab it. Grab the wood. There we go. Oh, it's the golf thing, right? Yeah. This is fine. Keep looking up to make sure I'm not going over an hour. I think I, it looks like I can do about two two days. A video? I mean, I, I still feel like I got a ton of stuff done today, which is awesome. All right, get out of this. I need to come over here. I need to make this thing. I need to make this thing. I need to make this thing. All right. Wait, isn't it two? Oh my god. So we have to wait till the apple tree grows again. And yeah, I mean that's all. My freaking inventory. What is this? Is that what I just got? Or are they going bad soon? No, I have no idea. Sorry, I don't mean to keep popping you out, man. All right, well, I, I guess I'm gonna come in here and what is it? What, what is it? Oh yeah, it's exclamation mark eating food. I'm gonna start with this. I'm hoping I could just start selling these things, but it doesn't look like that's a possibility. All right? Well, is that all? That doesn't really give me a whole lot. Right. We go. I got 17 aroma on it. All right. The most I can put in there. I might as well cook some of this stuff up to get it out of my inventory and to have foods for if I need them. See, like some of this stuff says it's going bad. I assume that is anyways. Let's throw you in there. All right. Uh, looks like I have to throw a mushroom in. I didn't mean to stir, I meant to do this. All right? And then tomato. Oh, don't don't stir yet. I'm trying to for these aroma things. There we go. That is a pretty good score. Seaweed surprise and fungi bites and the fruit compost. Okay. All right, this is fine. That away. Is there anything else I can go do real quick? Not really. I have six dollars in my name. Some of these I could sell. And why, why, why do you sell me exclamation mark? I don't understand. I don't see anywhere saying things are gonna go bad with them. Hey. Okay, I'm gonna cook up this one. I did it in the wrong order. I regret everything. All right. Okay. Uh. Okay, just keep doing this. Wow, that gives me a lot. Oh, I can actually do an egg. So 
Serve dish. What are we getting? Tomato souffle and cheesy skins with runny oaks. Alright, I got a whole bunch of dishes and I've like lowered my stuff by quite a bit. Oh yeah, they said they wanted things with extra vigor, right? So... Is this one carry with vermin slices? Okay, so the vermin slice... Oh, well, I guess that would make sense. I don't have any, though. I mean, I can start with the crab. This would probably do well, too, right? Um, wait. Oh, no, because it's the mushrooms. No, we're not going to have any combos. Lame. Alright. Nothing? Oof. Oof. This is not going to be the highest of quality of dishes. Yeah, no, it's not. Oh, I'm sad. Alright, crab cakes and salted shells and starchy cream. Yeah, that wasn't that good. Alright, well, you know what? I think I'm going to call it an early night. Go to sleep because wait 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 what's it? What can I do here? Am I falling asleep? I apparently can just sit there. Oh, wait. If I just is it just like sitting there? Enough of this for today. Oh, okay. I can do that every day. Now let's sleep real quick. It'll save until it'll save in the morning time. Hey. Night of nothing. All right, and it saves our game right here. Yes. I not think too much about this. Why? Why can I not just open it? Change clothes. That's right. I have other clothes. What the heck? Uh, no, I wasn't done changing my clothes. What am I wearing? This. No. Get rid of that. I kind of want to take this one. I like this one. Pilot jumpsuit, adventurer armor. Take me sign not included. Burning oil from a pan, not the only one. Not, but from a pan, not the one in sieges. All right. Actually, you know what? I'm I'm down with this. Yeah, totally gonna equip that. But but. All right. There we go. So we got armor on now too. But yeah, I think I'm gonna leave it here for now. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Keep hitting the like button, leaving comments down below. And as long as this keeps doing well, I'm going to keep doing this, because this is fun. I've had, I've had a ridiculous amount of fun with this game. Oh yeah, thank you for watching. Bye-bye for now.